Hey, Sean, the snapshot guy here, just bringing you the five-day challenge snapshot. All right, first thing I want to show you is um, when you get this snapshot, you're going to get this handy-dandy documentation right here. It's got just it's just documentation. It's an outline of everything that's included. So it's got the pipeline. It's going to be five different stages of the pipeline. The membership area where once someone uh, registers for the snapshot, they, this, the challenge is um, prefaced on the fact that you will be re doing a live challenge whether on YouTube or in a Facebook group or somewhere all the recordings will live in the regular members only area for people that don't upgrade or a VIP experience area uh, looks something like this okay so um, this is just like the back end so you're just gonna have two different areas and in the automations I'll show you where if someone upgrades then they uh, they get access revoked to this one and they get access granted to this one so every single day you'll just upload the recording of whatever the challenge is to the appropriate uh, members area I'm just gonna show you so you can see there's like a day one replay then there's a day one VIP replay and the other one you guessed it there's no day one VIP replay so that's really the only difference um, custom values we got just this you know small handful of custom values and they're organized into different folders we have the challenge branding and links so you can just oh let me let me see if I can just pull it up okay cool right here so you come into the custom values area in your settings let me just get rid of this guy uh, you come here into the folders challenge branding and links just click on that and you're just gonna update all these different things the host name the logo just hyperlink right to it the challenge name uh, your high ticket offer that you'll be giving everyone um, you'll be selling at the end of the challenge the link to that particular offer right here link to the Facebook group or whatever group uh, people get added to once they join the challenge where you're going to be hosting the actual live challenge videos link to the VIP upgrade page um, and the VIP upgrade name I just named it that let's see the challenge dates and times you're gonna set um, end date end time start date start time pretty straightforward and the replay links so every single day will have its own replay links right here um, do to do, do what else we got oh my goodness my washing machines going crazy so there is the custom values the different workflows um, I went through and just documented all the workflows here um, each one is really connected to a stage of the pipeline so when someone registers for the challenge you see the trigger here and the actions anything that um, is sending an email out you can see there's a marketing email template this isn't hyperlinked this is just so you know to update that email it's in the marketing email templates section let's just go ahead and uh, let's just jump over here um, so you can kind of see so you can see each of like the daily reminders and the replays let's say you know day three email two um, this is you know a replay so logo will go here we got this all this stuff in here they can watch the replay insert screenshots of social proof so right here what you're gonna do before you send the replay link out is when someone is um, you know you're gonna have someone managing the chat on your challenge and taking screenshots of different questions and different things being said and you're gonna go ahead and you're gonna insert those screenshots of social proof of people that are active in the challenge right here so that those get sent out after you know, a couple hours after the challenge ends and it's like oh my gosh these people are on it so you're gonna have the logo this is gonna be linked to um, the actual challenge replay also gonna change the thumbnail of to the actual video right here um, let's see insert the hook desire for the training let's see we just wrapped day three of the blank challenge and wow I'm fired up today was incredible change this statement every day all the yellow stuff is stuff that you're gonna have to change um, topic from the training insert screenshots of social proof down here today I unpacked insert theme so there's a little bit of work that goes into it but you're running a business here so you're working um, points one two and three focus on three to five points link to the replay day three homework look forward to seeing insert outcome of the challenge 
See you tomorrow for day four, blah, 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 blah. Give them a CTA, or this is for day three. Give them a CTA, typically to upgrade to VIP if they haven't yet. The day four and the day five ones, it'll have um, upgrade links to the high ticket offer that was presented. So this is just a quick little tidbit of examples, you know, an example of one of the emails. Super duper easy. Um, you can go ahead and I would say just go through all of the emails based on your videos and um, based on what you're going to present and you're going to want to customize those customize those they're like 90 percent of the way there it's all of this regular general text it's whatever but in here you're going to want to go ahead and you are going to customize it for whatever your offer is if you're you know a write your book challenge or a weight loss challenge or build your business challenge everyone's going to have different hooks different call to actions things like that um, so workflows we have the register for the challenge workflow submitted or the trigger is it submitted uh, the challenge registration form opportunity created all this stuff another workflow is upgrade to VIP another workflow um, what, what's this one oh upgrade to VIP workflow and then the challenge reminders I'm just gonna put this down on the next page um, workflow, the cart closing workflow. They haven't bought the challenge offer yet, and or they bought the high ticket offer workflow. So this does not have um, all the upgrades and everything that have to go with the high ticket offer. This is just the challenge. So whatever your high ticket offer is, you already have that in place. Whether it's a group, whether it's a course, whatever it is, this is the challenge. So this is the um, lead generation, customer generation, filling up, getting opportunities for people to buy your high ticket offer five day challenge. This is not the high ticket offer as well. That'll be a completely different snapshot if you already don't already have one in place. Um, right here, I'm gonna just enter this down because it was bugging me. Okay, cool. The forms, there's only one form right now. Um, there is, okay, the uh, funnel reg or the challenge registration form, first name, and then email address. And then the funnels themselves. Um, I went ahead, I created these graphics for you. Let me just go ahead and zoom in. You can see the registration page, the VIP upgrade page and the thank you pages right here. If they, yes, they do upgrade, there's a different thank you page. No, they don't upgrade. Different thank you page down there. And then also the challenge high ticket offer page. There's an order form page, or funnel. There's an order form page and there's a confirmation page there as well. Okay, cool, you can see the two different funnels right here when I go to the funnels area. Um, challenge registration is laid out exactly like that picture. There's a registration page. VIP upgrade, thank you, no upgrade, thank you, yes upgrade. Let's go ahead and check out um, the registration page right here. So you can see it's got the live five day launcher challenge challenge. So this is the challenge name, it's a custom value on the back end. Um, you're ready to whatever the payoff is. It's gonna be a little bit of manual customization. Done everything I can to go ahead and uh, make as much of it updated, updatable as possible using the custom values, however, it is best practice to go in, change out the images, change out the colors and branding, and fix as much of the text as possible so it fits your language and your offer. Um, you know, it's, it's a business, it is what it is. But this is the, the header, what people will see when they land on the page. They can come down here. This is like a, a video, a little presentation video to get people to take the challenge. Um, it's like a wow teaser video type of thing. All of these buttons just open up a pop-up form which has the same image that's in the hero so you're gonna wanna um, make sure to match that. All you're doing is a background image for a column. And then we have the headline. Ooh, I gotta change that. Um, that should be a custom value. And then a little bit of subtext and then the same form. You know, Every single button that's on this page takes you to that same pop-up. There's one call to action on this home page. A little bit of info on day one, day two, day three, day four, day five, 
What are you waiting for? What you can expect before the challenge, after the challenge. Here's everything you get. Bonuses. Yay. Click the button. Register. Yay. Cool. So, and then the VIP upgrade page, I'm going to walk you through this one as well. Because this one, um, that first page, people register for the challenge. They don't enter any card information at all. So, um, this second page, yes, there's another video here. It's going to be you saying, wait, you want to upgrade to our VIP experience where you get an extra hour with us every single day after the main presentation where you get a question and answer with the challenge host, Sean Faber. And you're also going to get these bonuses and you're also going to get recordings of everything and you're also going to get and you're also going to get right now it's only $97, whatever it's going to cost. So once you leave the page, offer disappears except for in the upgrade emails. Um, so they can click here, say yes. Give me VIP access. Um, I need update things. That's not supposed to go to. Uh, that is supposed to open up this pop up. So um, let me just refresh this. I want to. I want to clean that up a little bit. So each of these buttons is supposed to open up the pop up form. Let me see. Okay, cool. It's supposed to open up the pop up form, which has the order form, it has a little presentation of the VIP bonuses, what the bonuses are, guarantee, all that stuff. When you upgrade, you get this, this, and this. Here's a testimonial. What's included? This. Oh no. Space is limited. Upgrade and you'll receive this, 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 and this. Yay. Um, don't forget, only a thousand VIP slot, slots available. Here's everything again. So that's the VIP page. Okay, I fixed it now. So every time someone clicks on one of these upgrade me to VIP buttons, it takes you to this form. Uh, who's upgrading to VIP? Name, email, cell phone number for text reminders, street address uh, for bonuses, complete your upgrade, payment information. Um, and whenever they click no thanks, I'll show you what it looks like here. They click no thanks. I don't want that. It actually, um, let's see, oh, just, okay, I fixed it. Um, it's a button, and so it just takes some links to the next step, which the next step in the funnel is the thank you, no upgrade. If they complete the order form, you know that's on the pop-up, if they complete this order form, then it is set to take them to the thank you yes confirmation page. So, perfect. Cool. All right, just a moment. Wait, I don't think we need any more moments because we went through um, the pages of the snapshot. You can see there's two different funnels included. We have the challenge registration funnel. We have the high ticket offer upgrade funnel. So this goes out on, um, you know the final day we got the automations let me walk through these yep we have the registered for the challenge challenge reminders you just go to the challenge reminders page um, this is trigger added when someone registers um, which day of the challenge is it day one update opportunity in, ch in challenge oh yeah let me show you the pipeline in a minute uh, wait two hours for the challenge, email day one, reminder, two hours before, and then it waits for five hours later, so the an hour after the challenge ends, that's when the replay goes out and goes to day two. So day two, all that stuff, and then day five, they get the last day tag added, and that triggers the automation where um, reminders for the challenge offer like the high ticket offer and at the end of day five they get this did they purchase the offer update the opportunity they purchase the offer remove them from the workflow cart closing that's the other automation if they did not purchase yet at the end of day five then um, they did not purchase the offer they get updated to that stage of the pipeline let me go ahead and just show you the pipeline real quick people who register non VIP register VIP currently in challenge they'll be tagged as VIP so you'll be able to see that on all the opportunities there they completed the challenge no upgrade they completed the challenge purchased the upgrade so this is everything you need to run a five-day challenge it has the funnels it has the opportunities pipeline 
it has the automations, it has the custom values, it has the pre-built email marketing templates, um, daily reminders for VIP, daily reminders for non-VIP, abandoned carts for VIP upgrades, a VIP welcome email if they purchase the challenge offer, there's cart closing emails, there's a challenge registration email as well. All of those are pre-built. All the automations are pre-built. You can go ahead, make buku bucks with this challenge and get a ton of people not only on your list and paying to be on your list, but also joining your high ticket offer and building your authority as an expert in your field. If you want this, go ahead and um, click the link, purchase it, add it to your business, add it to your portfolio, get it set up, start running traffic to it and go make a ton of money. Until next time, I'll talk to you later. God bless you.